Welcome back everyone! I'm Ray, and today we are going to continue the event. Heck yeah! <laughs> Before we dive into it though, if you enjoy my videos, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, it would really make my day. And I want to jump into it. I'm really curious right now, because they kind of tease that it could get very, very depressing very soon so i hope it will not but i don't know so let's take a look at unconscious lady the sunken chapter two and um i really want to try to voice even better i will voice them someday at a rate that is very good but we'll see <laughs> after breaking through the clouds of mount chongshu the turbulent sea came rushing over in a flash, the great sea of airship sank. Wait, what? Wait! Oh, oh, sank. I'm- oh my god. I was so confused right now. I was like, sinking. In the sense of a boat is sinking, you know? And not an airship is getting lower. Anyway! <laughs> hey! The story ended just as it was starting! <laughs> well, th that happened. Some time passed. Somewhere on the shore of the sunken, Veronica stood up shakily and removed a starfish stuck to her. <laughs> Is everyone okay? Okay, so it seems like it was not a good landing. Ew, I taste seawater. Tonya! She's gone. So is the CEO and that chicken. They seem to have been washed away by the sea. Didn't she boast that her black chicken could easily reach the land of the sunken? Unbelievable. Forget her. Let's find Tonya first. Right. A few moments later, let's find them. There is no sign of them on the shore nearby. Maybe... No, wait. There are plenty of footprints other than ours on the shore. She must have left or been rescued. We need to look elsewhere. The sunken, like Mount Chongshu, is controlled by a boss. As long as we go deeper, we will find the city ruled by that boss. And then we defeat them and then everything is ours. <laughs> Tonya must be there. Let's go. What? Let's move. No. It looks like someone fainted over there. Could it be Tonya and the others? What is that pose? <laughs> the Hawthorne kid ran over to find a woman lying unconsciousness on a coral in the distance. Is it our new team member, maybe? Head up there and check out what's going on and take a detour. I mean, we have to check it out. How is she? She doesn't look good. She seems more than unconscious. What is more than unconscious? Oh my god. Don't kill me like this. Who's there? Hands up. That character's name sure is straightforward. Feels like they put the description where the name goes. <laughs> huh? You've got it wrong. Let me explain. No tricks. Put your weapons down. Huh? What's with all the sudden hostilities? Maybe we made the wrong choice. Should we try choosing differently? Wait, really? Okay, it's a good thing I saved earlier. Really? What? <laughs> she shows symptoms of poisoning. We don't have time to lose. Alright, let's search for a doctor nearby. Okay. Well, seems like uh, it's just the illusion of free choice. I mean, I kind of thought so. The Hawthorne kid tries to pass the woman in front of her, but her foot slipped and bumped into the woman. Who's there? Hands up. But this is the same. She's she's so good looking. Huh? Y you've got it wrong. Let me explain. No tricks. Put your weapons down. Uh, looks like it's a fight no matter what we choose. Okay, so that's actually very fun. Wow. So it's, it's even the illusion, <laughs> the illusion of choice for them. Oh, that is just so, that is inception. Pepper Senpai, hurry and join the battle. Yeah, for real. Stage sunken unlocked. Wait, where do we go first? Do we first go to sunken? Or do we first go to the sunken guard? I have no idea. Let's go to the sunken. Shortly after the great CEO sank, CEO and Ku washed up on shore. Okay, it's awesome. 
Oh, that was so salty. <laughs> Are you a League of Legends player too, huh? Dude, I didn't expect the Great CEO to leak. Guess it's best to test things out first. But at least the two of us are alright. Cool, cool. <laughs> cool. I can't let the boss know I was the one that pecked at hole in the sh in the oh. It was you? Oh my god. <laughs> huh? What are you talking about? Cool. That said, that huge weight that brought me to shore left me unscathed. Cool, cool. Okay, I think I will just say that's why you're the boss. <laughs> I kind of thought it was funny at first, just saying what it says, but no. That's why you're the boss. At first, I also thought it was because I'm so fit, but that doesn't seem to be the case. From underneath there came a terrifying noise. The noise sounded particularly annoyed. <laughs> I think we've landed on a monster. Huh? Oh, of course, but I can't do that yet, right? Or wait, can I? <gasps> Let's do that. Oh, I'm actually kind of hyped. And we can play Fuhua. I want to play Fuhua so bad. Let's play Fuhua. Hell yeah. Okay, here we are. Can I first look around at the stage? Because wow. I'm sorry, I'm just so in love. Are you the beast? Oh, those cubes. <laughs> I'm sorry, those cubes are always just like, aha, uh -huh, it's dead again. Wait. Oh my, stop. Let me, let me dodge. Actually, it's not good standing in this. It's in burst mode with its boost speed. I have no idea how to do any of her combos as usual. Can you stop attacking me? I want to try combos, okay? No. <laughs> Hello, that is so mean. Okay, I think I have to swap because I'm so bad. Awesome. With awesome, I mean typical. <laughs> it's kind of very typical for me. I'm sorry, guys. I swear, someday I will be able to use every battle suit at least um, on a normal level, I think. <laughs> Wait, what? What was that? You didn't even try to attack this enemy. Zele. Don't disappoint me like that. Let's ult one more time because it looks so good. Oh my god, it's it's I I love this way too much. <laughs> like she just looks awesome. Her her visual design, it's uh, Zilla could be like just a visually her whole design. Like not just one bell suit, but just like how she is designed in general. Could be definitely my favorite overall <laughs> just because it's just so cool with the two personal i mean not two personalities but kind of two personalities anyway with those two people in one can you not attack me like this do you think it's safe for me to finish it with Fuha? no no it's not it's not it's not it's not <laughs> oh i did it how did I do that? <laughs> How the heck did I do that in the last second? I just pressed every key. And I'm not exaggerating. I just pressed every key. <laughs> anyway. Awesome. We did that fight. So let's go to the sunken guard. Heck yeah. Is Durandal joining us next? I really want her to join us next. But will it only be after this chapter? Ah, uh, I want her though. So bad. Okay, huh? Why did this one change outfit all of a sudden? Wait, who? Oh, she. Could it be the magic girl transformation? That is exactly it, yes. Is, is there really such a ferocious magic girl? <laughs> My guess is the devs didn't have time to develop new combat mechanics for the new model. It's a demo after all. <laughs> I love those those comments from them. I wish they would comment even more while the characters talk. Like, not just every now and then, but more comments because it's really fun. And I love this Durandal suit so bad. Guys, you don't know. <laughs> I mean, actually you don't know yet, but I mean, I will do the tutorial very, very soon. I mean, if it's the suit that I think it is, but I think 
This is the new one, right? What are you doing? This looks dangerous. It looks like it hurts. Don't do that. Come on. Leave me alone. I mean, not leave me alone. Honestly, join us. Okay, let's go with her again. I have no idea what each old instance does for this Sele. I've never read through her attacks like this. Because I'm just like, it just looks awesome. <laughs> and you know, I love designing. I love everything about this. Why are you attacking me? That's so mean. Yeah, I just wanted to say I um, am doing, have done at this point, the tutorial stages. And they will be up very soon. My reaction to it, I mean. <laughs> Which I hope will be kind of entertaining. So, uh... Seeing her here is really just like, I want her so bad. I really like this too. But I just like Durandal in general, so that could also be it. <laughs> I mean, who doesn't like Durandal? Honestly, who doesn't like any of these characters? They are all awesome in their own way. <laughs> and okay, it's, it just turned into me fangirling about everything, but we are all here for that. Is that enough of a beating? Now knock it off, you should have realized by now we're not here for a fight. Seems that way. On closer inspection, you are still kids and probably not bandits. Kids. <laughs> She's just like, I'm not a kid. You shouldn't act on impulse like that. We are... The Hawthorne kid explained clearly the reason for the, their arrival to the night. So your visitors from another world? Excuse my lack of manners. I apologize for my rashness. I am the Midway Knight and captain of the Sunken Mayoral Personal Guard. Interesting. Who's the mayor? Who is the mayor? It would be kind of fun if it would be Rita, because then their roles would be kind of reversed in the sense of that Rita's above Durandal. That would be kind of fun. <laughs> the one passed out here is our Midway Adjutant. We run into unforeseen circumstances and have been on edge. Apologies. Oh wait, maybe maybe that's Rita, the one unconscious. Ah, uh, but who's the who's the mayor? What circumstances exactly? Our adjutant, she she has fallen to the ancient beast's curse. If she isn't cured in twenty four hours, she will become like the others. The ancient beast. Maybe I heard that name before. That jerk CEO mentioned it. Sounded like a monster sealed away in this world. The ancient beast is a magical creature residing in the sunken, si sunken since ancient times. Its curse causes people to go mad and become violent. So, kinda Ponkai, but not really. Ancient beast? What kind of name is that? Probably just lost in translation. Translated over from different languages. <laughs> I love their, their meta-ness. <laughs> you said, like the others. You don't mean... It lay dormant for years. But just a few days ago, it reappeared, cursing any and all of the people in the sunken. So many people have been... That's terrible. If it's true, then... Perhaps the same thing happened to Tonia. You've lost someone? She's probably in the palace as all roads lead to it. If she was rescued, she had been taken there. It'll, I'll take you there and we can search on the way. In return, you can help look after our adju adjutant. <laughs> These words. <clears throat> Good idea. Grandpa always said to look after one another. What do you think, Bronica? Sure, I'll give you a hand. Alright, I'm in. It's a good thing you can take care of yourself, despite your size. I want to hurry this up and change back. <laughs> Thanks a million. Well then, let's go this way. I completely forgot how every voice sounds. L like, really. I forgot every character's voice, maybe except for Sele. So, um, yeah, I have no idea how, <laughs> how Durandal sounded, <laughs> sounded like. Anyway, that does not matter. We are in the sunken three. Interesting, let's go. We can play Durandal here. No way. No way. Oh, that is awesome. Okay, I'm totally up for it. Oh, wow. That area is gorgeous. Oh my god. I'm in love. <laughs>
This area is incredibly gorgeous and I love the way that the floor came into being. Watch out for the traps they set up here. Oh. Oh no. A lot of rolling ice balls in a narrow path. Avoid them. Yeah, I see that they explode. So let me just... Uh... <laughs> oh, these are... Oh my god, I love how she kicks. Guys, I won't get too much too deep into how or what I think of this drop bell suit because <laughs> you will see that soon enough. Okay. One thing I'm saying though is the freaking kicks. I mean, okay. Okay, wait, wait. Oh my god. Okay, stop this. You are annoying me. I I had it with you guys now, okay? I love the way that she hits and kicks and God damn it. This just makes me... Oh my god, can you please stop? You're so annoying, whatever you are. I don't like you. You're kind of like a crab. Oh my god. Thank you, anyway. Yeah, guys, just the kick. That is hot, okay? <laughs> that is just hot. Oh my god, not this again. Can I just... Oh, oh my god, that is, yeah, that's not what I wanted to do. I actually wanted to evade in the red. I'm sorry. I am sorry, I did not want that to happen. Wait, actually, I sh should use Theresa to just walk around, I think. Oh my god, it ex it's exploding in, wait, where do I have to go? Okay, not this way. I think I will walk around with Theresa because I probably won't attack with her. So let me just run through all of that. And let's not die again. I can't believe I let Durandal die and I am more than terribly sorry, okay? I really did not. I, I, <laughs> I did not think that I was capable of dying in these stages here. And I mean from a, how in, incompetent I am sometimes. <laughs> Okay, I am scared by these enemies because they are attacking so much. Does she deal a lot of damage or not? Oh, not at all. Okay, does Theresa deal more damage? Also not really. Awesome! Oh my god, did she just throw teriyaki? Can you guys stop shielding? I hate you when you are shielding yourselves. You freaking... Little... Annoying cuties. They, I mean, they kind of look cute, right? That's not just me, is it? I mean, maybe it is. Honestly, I don't know. Okay, I'm so glad that I have a brony here and I know what she does. Because if not, I would be really lost. But how the heck am I so bad at this game? <laughs> like, name one person who's, who's worse at this game than me. These things, are they really residents of the sunken? The Sanken was once a peaceful place, and despite their looks, those were once its peaceful residents. No way. But under the monster's curse, they have lost their minds and making the city a dangerous place. If your adjutant isn't cured in time, will she change too? Yes, so we must hurry, and the more time we waste, the more danger your friend is in. Alright, let's get going. <laughs> Let's rescue Zele and the adjutant. Oh, okay, now we are deserted gaming heaven. What? It's so dark, where am I? Huh? What's this? So fuzzy. I'd moved! Someone save me, it's a monster! How about letting go of my beautiful plumes? <laughs> ah, a light. Let's see now. Ah, oh, it really is a monster. No fear, I'll take care of it. Oh, she's so... She's so funny. It's me, everyone's favorite coo. Yeah, that's, that's actually true. Seems like it's trying to communicate. Pity I can't understand it. As the doctor, blade in hand, stepped toward coo, a figure appeared in a flash and got in her way. Doctor, stop this. I will not permit you to treat my number one employee like this. Of course you're here. Maybe you can tell us all what happened with your magnificent airship. Someone must have forgotten hull maintenance. <laughs> no biggie. I mean, we're all alive, aren't we? This is so... Like, this... Fuhua is so different than the Fuhua that I know so far, so that's actually very fun. Oh, is that so? We'll see how long that lasts. What are you talking about? Veronica, they're gonna fight! Ugh, she's really babysitting her. Huh? 
Veronica pulled CEO away from the doctor. This isn't the time for a fight. CEO, what about Tonya? Was she with you? Nope. After the crash, the only one nearby was Q. I thought she was with you. I couldn't find them. I checked all along the road and now I'm here. Speaking of, where is here? That is a good question because it's the arcade. It's an arcade. Oh, that is fun. I also just got here. Everything is pitch black, but I think it's an arcade. Huh? See for yourself. The seal pointed behind her at a wooden sign that stuck out. In a child's writing were the words, The Sunken Game Paradise. There are plenty of coin o coin op arcade games around. They're all powered up, though. Midway night. Didn't you say you'd take us to the palace? This isn't... This is the palace. Okay. <laughs> Everyone was surprised to see the midway night's knights once Ulster face twitched suddenly. This is the palace's vestibule. Try not to ask too many questions. Why do I get the feeling you're hiding something? Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of... Mm, this is a sus again. You'll understand when you see the city's mayor. Come with me. The mayor should be right here. I mean, I see the twins back there, I think. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> no need to look. We're right here. Who? My fellow guests and warriors. Captain Vodka and Chief Officer Vodka. Welcome all to the sunken game paradise. Okay, are those skins or battle suits? I think they're battle suits, right? They are. <laughs> they look so cute. I'm the manager here, Captain Vodka. Wait a second. Didn't we agree I'm captain today? We have new guests. Let me do one more day. Then you can be captain two days in a row. Fine. In that case, I'm the other manager, Chief Officer Vodka. Welcome to the Sunken. Hope you all enjoy your stay. Where am I? Why did I... Why did I join this? Travelers, allow me to introduce the esteemed mayors of the Sunken, Captain Vodka and Chief Officer Vodka. I... <laughs> I swear, if I don't get an answer in the main story why they are always called something with vodka, I uh, will be very confused. You're joking, right? I understand why you'd say that, but it's true, they run this place. Back when it was their mother who took us in. Ah, oh, you must be kidding. These two brats are the mayors. Wow, now you're getting it. When you think about it, it's not all that strange. I mean, Mount Chongchu's boss is a little brat too. Oh, <laughs> takes one to know one, you know. Um, C Captain Vodka, Chief Officer Vodka, we are, and we explain it. Bronica explained their reason for coming. Meanwhile, the adjutant was taken into the city to rest. And now you know our whole story. Captain Dummy, you mean now we know their whole story? Like, they are still the best comedic duo here. Madam Mayor, these travelers helped me and the adjutant. Perhaps we can offer them assistance? Of course, is what I'd like to say. But our city is a bit preoccupied with the crisis at the moment. The monster? That's right, you saw the city's residents before coming here, right? Most of the residents have lost their minds to the curse. It was once an underwater gaming paradise, but now no one comes to play. Oh, that is tragic. <laughs> A wave of vandalism took hold, smashing up the building and arcade machines. Wait, what was the sunken paradise like before all this? Why build an arcade in the palace? You don't know? It's to help get ready for the biggest celebration on earth. Celebration? You aren't trying to become the new king of celebrations, are you? Not again. Yep, but me and my chief officer aren't exactly the best at running a city. So all the money was lost in investing in the arcade. It's all the captain's fault. Not true. If it wasn't for this curse, this arcade would be the best place for celebration. <laughs> this? It's got nothing on Mount Chongshu. Indeed. <laughs> what? CEO, don't make things worse. I can't whistle. I'm exposed now. Madame Mayor, finding a cure to the curse is the most pressing thing right now. 
All right, true, true. We have to save the midway adjutant and our citizens. Come with us. Huh? You have a plan. We must go see the goddess of the sunken. There is a goddess now? Yeah, we were in the palace thinking of ways to stop the curse. Then, when I started feeling hungry, we suddenly heard a thud and a cry. A girl fell from the sky and the current dropped her on our throne. That is Sela, huh? That is Tonya, right? From the sky. Did this girl have blue hair? Yeah, her hair is blue! <gasps> How do you know? Captain Dummy, it's their friend that got separated. <laughs> At least one of them knows. <gasps> oh yeah, how did I not realize? But you didn't realize it either. I... I was. <laughs> anyway, everyone, please come with us. Trying to get out of it, huh? Wait for me. Try to keep up. This is way too fun. This is so fun. I can't. I... <laughs> This really feels like a typical game story. I mean, in a game. I mean, you know, the typical stuff. <laughs> we are here. Captain Vod Vodka spoke a few words to a conch and from the sea appeared a massive palace. Is this a simulated light curtain? I thought only Dome City had this tech. Yep, I don't really know how it works. Just that it keeps the palace safe. Monsters can't find us inside. Our mother, um, uh, the last mayor, gave it to us. She told us how it worked, but Captain Dummy here didn't get it. <laughs> like you understood. Enough, the goddess is waiting for us. Let's go inside. This is way too good. Ooh. Oh, that's so cute. Goddess, it's me. I've brought some guests for you. Don't call me that. I'm not a... Tonya. <gasps> Bronica and my sister. Are you alright? You're not hurt. I'm good. Don't worry. The captain and chief officer have been very good to me. I was just telling them what happened. Oh, they look identical. Of course they are sisters. How did I miss that? <laughs> We're sisters, but we don't look alike. Yeah, you're right. Oh, my head hurts. Actually, they do look alike. Madam Mayor, this isn't anything to get a headache over. Anyway, this is great. Travelers, you found your friend. So what's the plan now? We're trying to get to Dome City at the top. Now that we've found Tonya, we can get going. You don't want to leave them behind, right? Great, I'll take you to the Coral Elevator and have you there in a few minutes. But Captain... Chief Officer Vodka looked like she had something to say, but then just shook her head. I mean, she wants help. <laughs> Knight, lead the way for our guests. Wait, what about the curse? We're indebted to you both. It'd be against my principles to just leave now. I want to help. Of course, yay! No sooner had the words left Bronica's mouth than Captain Vodka ran over and gave her a tight hug. Oh, that's cute! That's wonderful! I was worried you'd just leave. Thank you, Bronica. You... died... can't... breathe. We're saved. We couldn't do it alone. <laughs> Kids seem to really like you. What's the plan, Bronica? It's just an idea. It might not work. But this isn't the beast's first time appearing. They must have had a way of getting rid of it before. I mean, I only know the the way th that Theresa sealed her. I mean, not Theresa, but I, I forgot her name because I'm terrible with names. But then the last event. Right. What else did the previous mayor leave you, Captain? Maybe some sort of record? Record? Ah, something about getting rid of the beast? It's very possible. Yeah, but I can't think of anything other than this palace. Captain Dummy, what about that one thing? Huh? What one thing? Everyone looked to where the chief officer was pointing. Huh? Me? Wait, what? Not the goddess. The scepter of the sunken. Oh, <laughs> Scepter of the Sunken? Oh, you mean this thing you insisted on giving me? Yeah, it is pretty unusual looking. Tonya, check if the scepter is hollow at all. Sure thing, sis. Everyone gathered around. Tonya felt around the scepter. Ah, this might be an opening. The scepter's top twisted open, revealing a yellowed scroll. There it is. Read it, quick. 
Okay. Maybe out loud? Veronica, you were right. It says how to steal away the ancient beast. Really? How? It seems all you have to do is sing a chant. The notes are written here. I completely forgot. I'm all over the place. There are too many voices. The only thing I know right now is high, low, high, low. <laughs> Isn't this our lullaby? Oh, we should have realized how far-sighted our mother was. The previous mayor was just a bit too subtle. So you've both heard this song before? Of course, we've heard it ever since we were little. So all we have to do is sing our lullaby? Wait, isn't that ancient beast or whatever basically invisible? How do we find it? Don't worry, it says here that the lullaby causes the beast to show itself. What we need now is somewhere our song can be heard all throughout the sunken. <laughs> Sounds like my specialty. Huh? Don't worry, you'll see. She's bored, she's just like, oh, this is this is already over. Oh, my singing passion is coming up. Let me be the lead singer. I'll do the chorus and backup singing. And leave keeping Tl Tlaloc under control up to us guards. Count me in. I'm gonna knock that monster into the sky the moment it shows up. I, I want to help too. The fight to save our city and lift the curse starts now. <laughs> Why is this so fun? Like, all of those characters interacting, I mean, even though they are not the, the canon, I mean, not canon, but the main char main story characters, it is still very, very fun. So let's fight against the ancient beast. Oh, wait, is it? It's that stage again. Oh, no. Oh, but I'm so bad at this. Building theme for this stage, turret. Wait, what turret? Okay, no, I I'm glad. I, so I thought for a second that there was one more thing here uh no new building turret has appeared tap it to view details what is that when valkyrie ninja yai kasumi passes by the turret will deal 250 damage to an enemy on the field then the turret will be upgraded to level two all valkyrie strings wait so honestly all the time when yai kasumi passes by it will get stronger and attack an enemy is that right that's actually awesome. Wow. Okay. Let me first get a few blocks here, though. I need the Valkyrie Dorm. Okay. Let's think about it for a second, though. Valkyrie Dorms have to be to a supply depot. And the stages have to be to another stage. And the arcade has to be in the same... Okay, okay. I think... Okay. I think I know what I want to do for now. Maybe not, but I will try, okay? I will give it my all. <laughs> okay, so the next thing I want to do there is a Valkyrie Supply Depot, actually. Come on, give me a, give me a, another yellow one. Oh, wow, I really don't get a yellow one, huh? Okay, then uh, we will do another Valkyrie Dorm right here because I need it anyway. And we need Yaya Kasumi, so... <laughs> Let's, let, please give me some yellow. I just want yellow. This is not yellow. Frick. Okay, let's place another Valkyrie dorm. And I would say right here. I'm just honestly doing something and I hope it works. My plan is that the Valkyrie supply depot is always like right at those dorms, you know? And the stages be under those and the arcade just somewhere completely different. That's my plan for right now. So uh, honestly, I want to try to build one here and then one here as well. So that I can see if it works even double. Wait, it, it says if it stacks, right? Uh, this effect cannot stack. Oh, okay. So this is already... Huh. Then it was not the most cleverest... The most cleverest thing? What the heck? All over the place, I swear. I can't speak at all. Okay, I will, I will then do a stage here if this cannot stack anyway. So let's put this here. Awesome. The next thing I... Oh, I didn't click it, I swear. I want a Valkyrie Depot right here. So I need yellow. Um, okay. If I get... Yeah, okay. Never mind then, I will try to build... Right. Wait, 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 wait. Give me a second. 
if it's not to another arcade wait if it's not to another arcade wait so only arcades can't touch each other uh well now i realize that the last time i tried this i just really was a little bit stupid okay anyway <laughs> then let me do this here right red comes here yeah boop yellow comes here and now we are going to do i think we're going to do two stages here just because i want to three three and then i can do another arcade here awesome actually i think i kind of get the hang of it i'm just really really proud of myself wait a second though why can i not zoom out the last time i definitely could zoom out that's weird maybe i couldn't maybe i just thought i could uh arcade here okay um i totally forgot where i put stuff but i think i needed red for this one awesome and then we do one more here actually this is fun <laughs> this gets just way more fun over the time honestly even though i'm pausing 30 times at least another arcade here and another stage will be here actually i can i could put another arcade here but i'm thinking i want another stage here i can actually put two other stages here oh my god awesome wait one two and then here will be the next one okay i think i i think i'm not doing bad guys i'm actually very surprised i really <laughs> i don't think i'm really any good at those things so i'm just always like eh, it doesn't work wait where did i put the stages i need red for this one here awesome two here thank the stun he, he, here it starts sorry so, <laughs> sometimes i realize it like in those last videos i just randomly switch to german and i have no idea why or what happens in my mind i'm just really sometimes so trying to focus so much that i'm legitimately forgetting to to, to remember what language i was supposed to speak right now <laughs> okay actually strength is already pretty good here here and he oh here awesome i think I'm, I'm doing quite good i mean maybe i'm 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 complimenting myself too much <laughs> i mean sometimes you just have to be the one complimenting yourself right i think i'm actually doing quite okay i am surprised stop it i i pressed pause i swear um i want another one here actually wait what do i need red red for this one more damage i'm a little um I think I'm starting to get a little power hungry. I just want more damage here. I really want to see how much damage I can have. I think I got this. Awesome, and another blue. I mean, we will already try to fight this monster because I do not see any reason not to try this, really. I mean, I think we have enough strength. I mean, just, okay. <laughs> like, her rita is already very strong but our ninja here is just way stronger like she is she is so strong she can probably do her solo do it solo wait maybe not maybe it will really take more come on you can do it yai yai kasumi yeah i mean she can't do it solo but i mean she can do it i know i could skip the battle i kind of really don't want to why does it shoot me though like <laughs> i don't want to get headshotted okay that's just wait can she really do it alone oh that's so strong heck yeah one more time come on even though it's regenerating but who cares about regenerating easy awesome with a ghastly roar, the monster sunk into the sea. Haha, <laughs> we did it! It was the ceremony that did it, Captain Dummy, but at least the lullaby worked. And the curse? Has it been lifted? 
At that moment, the palace doors opened and a man eagerly rushed in. That is not a man, but it's okay. Rita! Captain, Madame Mayor. Adjutant, you, you are right. <laughs> they are just friends, sure. Yes, the air that surrounded me, it just disappeared in an instant. And as you can see, I'm all better now. Wonderful! Our adjutant is all better. That means we'll get to have snacks again. Dummy, it means the curse has been lifted. She's just so done. Which is great. Goddess! She said she was not a goddess. Let's just call her Tonia. Tonia really helped out. Veronica too! Zip, zap, zip, and just like that, there was a stage. I've never seen anyone do something like that. <laughs> it was nothing. It was your performance that really stole the show. It makes sense. Before we became mayors, we seriously considered becoming stars. <gasps> In the sky... Sorry, that was bad. <laughs> hey, are you fishing for compliments? That's who. I'm the CEO of Mount Chongshu. I get compliments from my staff every day. That's right. During that fight just now, you really showed us what you were made of. There, I complimented you for everyone. Why, you? All right, all right. It's not easy dealing with crisis like that. No need to fight. Are you hungry? <laughs> everyone can hear your stomach, dummy. I'm hungry. I was really active during our performance. I burned just as many calories. That settles it. I'm gonna have cakes. That is... M multiple cakes? Multiple. I will prepare dessert for Madame Mayor and the guest at once. Adjutant, you're still recovering. Please let me. But you're a guest. I want to eat Tonya's cake. That's what she said. <laughs> I agree. Well, if Madame Maya requests it by name, I accept the offer. But Tonya... A gleam flashed across the adjutant's eyes. Permit me to look on from the sidelines, just in case. Wait, Tonya. I mean, now I'm reaching. But just bear with me, guys. In Genshin, child, or Tataglia, has a sister named Tonya. What if she looks like Sele? Oh, that would be so awesome. I'm sorry, I would be totally up for that. That's <laughs> Sorry. Oh, okay. If I mess this up, she'll... No, I'm overthinking it. Now that you mentioned it, I haven't eaten since we left Mount Chungshu. If you wouldn't mind. Okie dokie, cake time! Hell yeah, cake time! I mean, cake, cake time is best time. Is it not? The sunken goddess, cake. While the adjutant and Tonya prepared desserts, the knight and Captain Vodka led the guards to patrol the sunken. Fully relieved, the group sat around waiting for Tonya to bring around dessert. Cake! 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 Captain Dummy, you can't wait quietly. Sorry for the wait. The cake is here. I want cake. Oh, this is cute! <laughs> what? Is that Bronia? Is that adult Bronia? That is adult Bronia. Look at... <laughs> look at all the faces. What the heck? Bronia just looks... I mean, Bronica. Bronica just looks like she... She is... She, she's bitten into something very bitter. What the... <laughs> and Rita is just like... Uh, I'm sure it'll be tasty. This is a cake. Wow, it looks familiar. Isn't this that painting? What's it called? Where's it painting from? Don't hurt yourself. Anyway, Tonya, you've really taken your craft to the next level. <laughs> I made the cake like this after the sunken. I hope everyone likes it. Master Tonya, to be so good at such a young age. Next week, I'll start to practice dessert making. I hope you'll be my food tester, Captain. You're all fired up, huh? No problem, give it a try. You can burn off the extra calories with training. What a great cake. Huh? Why so quiet, Captain Dummy? Passed out from hunger? The goddess. What? 
It's the image of the goddess. It looks just like the picture from when we were little. So is the main protagonist the goddess? Is that it? Captain Dummy, this... Huh? You're right. I see it too. What a coincidence. That's no coincidence. It really is an omen from the king of celebrations. I have a feeling something great is gonna happen. As soon as she said that, the palace door opened and a guard ran in. What happened? Captain, Madame Mayor, come quick. It's a total mess. A mess? It can't be. After the curse was lifted, everyone had flocked to the sunken game paradise. They probably want to play to forget about the curse. Especially the new tower defense game, the sunken defender. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> my intuition's never wrong. Chief officer, the sunken celebration has already begun. Let's join them. In celebration, all the games are on the house. Why do I have to pay for it, Captain Dummy? Hey, Bronica, want to take me on in the sunken defender? If you win, I'll take you to the coral elevator. Oh, that hurts. Show some manners. Let's do it. I want to give it a try anyway. When it comes to games, I never lose. She is so freaking smug. I love it. I love it so much. I love the characters with these characteristics so much. Then let's play. You're on. Everyone grabbed a piece of Tonya's cake and ran off to the arcade. <laughs> what suckers. It's not like the arcade is going anywhere. We'll just enjoy all this cake then. It's all ours. Yep, dig in. I mean, would be kind of very, would be so relaxing. So let's see the surprise attack, even though I don't want to be attacked. Meanwhile, in the palace. I'm stuffed. That was delicious. Where is everyone? Probably at the arcade. They really are children. I'm pretty stuffed, but we should probably go play a little too. Bronica! Who is the distant voice? <laughs> huh? What was that sound? Sounds like that Hawthorn bread. Oh! You're... A muffled thud was heard. Oh! She's under attack. Cool, let's go. You got it, boss. We'll show them who their mo most reliable friends are. Ah, that's actually kind of cute. Okay. Defend the sunken. Oh no, it's another one of those, right? Okay, I can do this. But uh, this time, I think I will really skip most of it. Wait, all Valkyrie strength plus true? Change the surrounding squares to lava squares. Lava squares around the volcano will spawn a lava homu every 24 seconds. The Valkyrie who defeats the lava homu gains strength. What the heck? Yeah. New building volcano has appeared. Tap it to view details. Thank you. Uh, I already read that. I don't want it though. <laughs> Okay, guys, I will see you when I'm done. And remember, tell me if you want to see all the fights or not. I mean, I could leave them in. I just, I just don't think it's interesting. So let me know for the last part. All right. So <laughs> now we can challenge this boss. Okay, so let's do this. I think I did quite well. Oh, maybe I should have healed my Valkyries though. Eh, we don't even need full life for this beast. We can do that easily. <laughs> Am I cocky? Absolutely. Rightfully so? Who knows? <laughs> but actually, I think it kind of looks very, very good. No, I really like... Actually, I kind of love that Honkai is really trying thousands of different modes and games in the game. That's really not something that every game does, but uh, it's kind of hella awesome that they do it. <laughs> and I already can see myself really enjoying this game, like in general. I kind of wish that it would kind of stay. It would be very funny, but anyway, <laughs> I won. Whoa, I was so close to destroying your city. Captain Dummy, Bronica just didn't want to beat you too badly. Again, let's go again. It's already 15 to zero. Madam Mayor, let our guests rest a little. I'll play with you. All right, let's change the game then. Like Monster of the Sunken. <laughs> go easy on me. Huh? I haven't seen Siwa or Ku. Where did they go? 
probably eating the cake in the palace and competing to see who can eat more. They sure like doing their own thing. Wait for me. I'll go get them. When we return, we'll head on to Dome City. Yeah, well, about that. Hmm. I'll go with you. Wait, wasn't she the one that was captured and then they went, or was it really not? Ha! Huh. Bronica and the Hawthorne kid went to the palace together. You know, through that freak accident, we were able to help the sunken prepare for its celebration. Yep, maybe Captain and Chief Officer Vodka really can become the kings of celebration. It's still hard to see these two kids having anything to do with such a legendary title. <laughs> I know what you mean. Huh? Sensing something was off, Bronica stopped and turned around. Bronica? Suddenly something unexpected happened in the blink of an eye. And wha what is that? What happened? Don't be mean. Looks like you've obtained a game Tiger 2 and you can unlock talents in chapter 2 now. If you find the stages too challenging, try to unlock talents from the talent screen. Unlocking talent skills significantly reduces stage difficulty. Okay, but I want to just fight the boss ninja. <laughs> I'm here for the boss ninja. We are fighting her. Okay. I will take a look very shortly at her skills. Yep. I have no idea. We will just fight. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. I love Fuha. I started to love Fuha even more now with, with the recent chapters that I did. If you haven't already, why did you not watch those? CEO arrived to only find the Hawthorne kid on the ground and the lightly armored stranger by her side. Ooh. I'm sorry, I love this armor. Understood. Take the target to Dome City. I'll return as soon as I've gathered up to Nathio's remains. Hey, did you attack this little brat? The ninja looking stranger turned around slowly. It's you, Mount Chong Shu's boss. You're not my ideal rival, but I'll still take you on. What a jerk. Oh, I'm so scared. Bad guys like you are solid proof why the world needs heroes like me. Come on, just give up and make things easier. Of course, of course they won't. So we have to fight. Let's go. I love Fuha so much. Oh my. <laughs> as aggressive as the rumors say. Oh yeah, I am, sorry. Ooh, that just looked awesome. I, guys, I have no idea what I'm doing with her. I just know that. I swear I dodged. What? What was that? Wait, did she just? Did she power up? Oh right, I'm swapping modes with with Q with this old thing. I totally forgot about that. Ooh, <laughs> I love this so much. Can I dodge? I, I I actually would like to do a perfect evasion one time. But okay, maybe not. Let's just do it not. Why why should we, you know? Ah, oh, this just looks so good. Okay, let's go. I, I, I have no idea what I'm doing, but let's go. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, that just looked so good. Heck yeah, heck yeah, heck yeah. I'm sorry, this is too cool. This is way too cool. I And I could never try to duplicate Fuha's voice, honestly. That's just such a special voice. Like, like it or not, like, it's Japanese Fuha's voice. But it's just a very special. I mean, if you like it or if you don't like it, you know. It is very, very unique. Nope, don't, 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 don't do that to me. Oh gosh. Ooh. Okay, I love that she is just hitting her with those chains. Like, what the heck? Like, is that not way too hot? I mean, maybe I shouldn't say hot. <laughs> I shouldn't say hot. <laughs> it's very, very awesome. That is one of my favorite animations that I've seen so far. It just looks so good. What is, what is she doing? Wait. Oh my god, two faces? No way. That's actually kind of very scary. No, don't leave, leave me alone. I just want to be safe, okay? Give me a second. Okay, this is with the chain. Alright. I really have some battle suits that I just saw. Like, the first time I saw them, I knew I wanted them. And this is one of them, like this poopa. Even though... <laughs> You probably really have to know her input and stuff. Did I invade her? Did I evade? 
I have no idea. Oh my god. Why is this so scary? Can I not be Half-Life though? That would be awesome. Ooh. <laughs> Let's do it again. I have no idea if that is what she says. But I love Buha so much. Whoa! That just feels way too strong, you know? Some attacks just feel overpowered. Wait, I'm scared. Wait, is she shielding? Of course she's shielding. Oh! Don't attack. I said don't attack me and what do you do? You attack me! Do you know how rude that is? Do you know how rude you've been to me right now? This is the sea. Oh, you're... Frick. Okay, now I'm actually in danger. Heck no. I actually could lose this. I have no idea how much uh, SP I need. For my old... No! It's the shield again! Please tell me that I recover HP in my ult. Please tell me, please tell me it is so. <laughs> oh, I really like to uh, drop very low. <laughs> but this Fuba is just way too fun. I really like it. Wait, what is, what is her name again? I don't remember. I never look at the names of all of them and that is a little weird, but let's look at this one. Mysterious Ninja. Is that all you got? All I got? I haven't even started yet. I don't have time to play. Your friends are almost here. Here, this is for you. The ninja flung a small object towards CEO, which she caught without thinking. What is it? What's this? Give it to doctor. You'll understand. Hey, I'm not done with you yet. The ninja pressed a button on her armor, distorting the light around her body until she disappeared without a trace. That is way too OP. Where'd she go? Ran off without a fight? What a coward. Some footsteps could be heard as the rest of the group were finally drawn over to the commotion. The Hawthorne kid, what happened? <laughs> Took you long enough. Ah, uh, uh, the brat's awake. Everyone, quick. We have to save Veronica. Oh, wait, did she take her? Veronica, what happened to her? They were attacked. Here, look at this. The attacker left it behind. This is some sort of footage. Captain Vodka, do you have something that can play video recordings? The arcade's monitoring equipment should do the trick. Take me there now. Yeah, now. <laughs> it's been a while since I last did this. Give me a sec. There we go. We've got a picture. Of course it's Raven. Ugh. Oh, that's interesting. They always choose the same people to be the bad guys, huh? Huh? Who's the lady with the evil grin? <laughs> I mean, the bad guy, obviously. The boss. Wait, the boss? Oh, she's Dome City's mayor? That witch to ambush us here in the sunken. I was too careless. She has Bronia Bronica once again. Says we have to save her. Wait, what did she want to tell us by leaving this? It's almost as if she were baiting us. Hm. I know what she's after. Me. I know too much about the inner workings of Sky Polis for her to let me go around freely. I'm afraid a trap has been set in Dome City, just waiting for me to return. But... But... I understand, Tonya. Even still, I can't leave Bronica there. Sis! Alright. <laughs> With me around? What's there to worry about? Maybe I'll get another crack at that ninja. And wreck Dome City in the process. Then Mount Chongshu will really stand out. Huh? You, you're Mount Chongshu's boss? <laughs> you're just figuring that out, kid? Maybe we should add your arcade to the list, too. Huh? But, but what are you talking about? Watch it, CEO. If we're gonna get Bronica back, we'll need your help. You need me? Yeah. Why? I don't want to say it again. What can I do? Since you're begging like that, I can't not help. To start hearing things at such a young age. What a shame. Let's get going now. 
Yes, Captain Vodka, lead the way. Come this way. I'll take you to the coral elevator. Let's go. Ooh. I thought everything, everything was wrapping up nicely and then a new powerful enemy had to suddenly show up. The mastermind is finally revealing herself. Things are really getting interesting now. But. But. Arahato. Where is Arahato? This game's gotta have Arahato in it, right? Yeah, actually, that are exactly my thoughts. Where is Arahato? Well, Pepper Senpai, I saw a picture with the name Arahato standing tall, so... So at least there is a picture of Arahato? Well then, Arahato should appear in Chapter 3, right? Back to the game! <laughs> well, actually, no, we're not back to the game! <laughs> Again, tell me about if you want to see me do those challenges or not or whatever. And um, yeah, guys, I'm really hyped. And I think this story is actually very, very fun. And I'm excited to do Data 3 or Chapter 3 in the next episode. Bye!